Hey DT fam, welcome back to the Chan. So in today's video, oh, before we get into this video, make sure you are subscribed to our channel, hit that bell button also to get notified every time we post a new video. Let's get right into the video. So in today's video, I thought that I should do a wig try on haul kind of thing uh, for you guys. All of my wigs are from Amazon, just to let everyone know, it's gonna be in the title anyways. But yeah, I just want to show you my wigs. I only have four, so it's not going to be that long of a video, but I am going to show you all of them, the prices of them, the name of them, the quality, and I will put them all on my head so you guys can see how they look. All right, so should I start with the worst wig first or the best wig? I feel like I should start with like a medium one. Should I tell you the colors first or should I just go right into it? I have a pink one. I have a black one. I have a blonde one, and I also have a red one. It's like an orange one. Did I already say that? Pink, black, blonde, red. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to try the... I'll try the red one on first. All right. Let's get right into this video. All right. So this is the first one, which needs a brush. She's um She's gone through it. Look at her. She's a little bit chaotic. Oh, my goodness. All right, I realized that I don't know how to cut lace front wigs, so ignore that part because when I got it, I didn't ask anyone for help. I've had these for like, I'm gonna say two years now. I could be wrong about that, but I feel like I've had them for a while, um, or this one specifically for a while. I never wear them out unless it's like Halloween and I just like am Kim Possible or something or Black Widow or something. But I normally wear them at home just to like dress up in because I'm still a kid. I'm 22 years old. Okay, she looks pretty good now. So this is the, I'm going to put everything like on the side here. Like that's the name of it. It's called Blue Bowl. It's 14 inches long, this one. Um, and yeah, it is a lace front. So you're meant to cut that nicer than what I did. But yeah, it feels really like thick and it feels like real hair like it feels pretty good and um yeah it has these little like clip things which i never use i don't know how to use them like correctly and it has it just this is the inside so it has these two clips here and then yeah so i'm gonna ruin my hair for this by hair it was cute while you lasted i need it um i need a hair tire to tie my hair up so normally I I just washed my hair so I don't really want to put hairspray in it because I might do something else with it within the next day or two. I feel like hairspray just ruins your hair unless you're about to like really go all out. So yeah, I brushed this part out. I also my struggle with wigs is I have a really small forehead which makes it really hard for me to hide the hair. Oh, and I also do it like a low bun. Well, this is not a tutorial on how to put a wig on, but I guess I can add this in. Also, I should have straightened my hair for this video. It would have made the wig look a lot better. Okay, hold on. I'll be back. Okay, so I have a low bun and all my hair back. I normally hairspray that part. Um, so now... These are like perfect size for my head. Like, I... Oh, okay. I'll make it look cute in a second. But it's also like tilted a little bit, like the, the hairline is, not the hairline, the parting of the hair is over there. This one's so cute in camera, oh my god. Um, I always wanted to be that type of girl who could like pull off any hair color, but I just feel like I can't. Especially like blonde blonde, like you'll see when I show you my blonde wig, I just, it's my least favorite one. But. I'll get to that in a second. So I gotta really brush it out to make it look a little decent. Sometimes I like wrapping it behind my ear to make it look like it's there. But every time I post like a wig on Instagram, I edit out my hairline kind of. I'm giving you the tea, but um, cause look at this. My hair goes too close to my freaking like eyebrow. Like I just don't have the right head for wigs, but So this is the first one. Um, I don't know how you guys feel about this one, but I kind of like it. I With filters and stuff, it looks really good. 
but yeah i don't know if i really wear this out it doesn't look like real real should i turn around for you guys the back is so bad all right here look this is the back obviously my bun is there so in the way but this is kind of cute oh my god it's really hot in here i'm gonna turn the air on so yeah this is called blue bowl um it's like an orange red kind of color um and it's 14 inches long i feel like i love this like length but like if i cut my hair this length i don't like it like it's a cute length oh my god i'm trying to make it look good i'm so sorry guys but yeah so i don't know if i said the price already this wig is 36 dollars from amazon um i feel like that's pretty good for a wig before i ever bought a wig i thought that they were like well there are some that are much more expensive than this but obviously this is like a cheap one but it's cute so with filters and stuff it looks really good all right so let's move on to the next one i'm gonna try on the blonde one just so i can get it over and done with i'm gonna try and make it look good but let's see all right say hi to my friend it's more yellow than blonde like that's why I, I don't know this was a bad one i should have gotten a, like a blue or something like something crazy but yeah these oh the feeling of this one is like better than real hair like it's so soft and oh my god it's amazing i actually looked it up i don't know the the inches in length but it is shorter than the other one you'll see in a second but this is her so this wig is also oh no it's not a lace front i'll put the info there i don't remember what it is but the inside looks like this it also has the clips and the little things there i don't even know what you use that for i don't use it um it's twenty dollars and 99 cents um, which is also very cheap for the quality. Oh my god. I know it's not like real hair quality. Ooh, she's bold in the back. Let's see. Oh god. Oh god. Oh my god. The back part is the- Oh. Honestly? I feel like I look like Sia. Okay, sorry. I was feeling myself for a second. It also has this like very defined part. Like the- I don't know. Like the Kardashians have those like really nice parts. The hair is like this. The only problem with this is the back. Like, I could not go out with this. The front is cute, but it gets shorter and shorter and shorter, and then the back is like that. I like this one, but it is my least favorite one. The quality, oh my god, it feels so good. Like, if my hair felt like that, amazing. What do you guys think? Oh! oh. Alright, on to the next. Okay, so this one is my first baby. This is the first one I ever got. She's a little uh, stressed right now. If I could dye my hair any color, it would be pink. Like, I want this hair color. Sometimes it looks like it would drain me out, but like, it's so cute. They don't shed. Like, I could brush it a lot and then maybe one or two will fall out, pieces of hair, but like, it doesn't really fall out. So this one is the same exact one as the first one that I showed you guys, the red one. It's the same exact wig, but just a different color. So they call this one like an orange pink. I mean, I guess, but like, it's more pink to me. I would say it's my favorite, but I think the last one that I'm gonna show you is my favorite. But yeah, let's try this one on. Okay. For like sit at home wigs or like Halloween wigs, costume wigs, these wigs are amazing. Like, it's all I need. This is my second favorite one i think it feels very thick at the bottom which makes it look a little like fake i think but what do you guys think i feel like this one looks the most real like it just goes on my head like it's not a wig you know like i can put it behind and it looks real yeah i think this one is really cute i could really see myself dyeing my hair this color i should have rated them all but whatever you guys rate them yeah, this is like my alter ego. This one feels good. Oh, let me show you the back. I don't really know how this one looks in the back, but it's also like, I need one of those bald caps. By the way, they do, not the bald caps, the ones, the caps that you put on, on your head before you put the wigs on, they all come with it. I just don't wear it because my forehead's too small anyway. So like putting it, whatever, it just doesn't work out for me. But yes, it does come with that also. 
I'm gonna go and try on the last wig. All right, so this is the last one. It's so soft. This is my favorite one, I think. This is like the Kim Kardashian, like, bob with the, the line in the middle. It's the same one as the blonde one, but it just looks better on me than the blonde. This one doesn't even need a brush. It's so silky and just like beautiful. So again, this one is $20 on Amazon, but it does have the same inside with the clips. I'm not gonna show you again. Oh. Oh. How do we feel? I think because this one is like the most realistic, it's black, like I could dye my hair black, like a natural color, so. This one feels so good on, like it feels just real and yeah. Doesn't it kind of look real? No? Am I bugging? So the back of this one, again, does not look cute. Um, that's a problem with these wigs, so it's not like something that you can really wear out unless you actually do the like cap underneath and like braid your hair or something so it doesn't have a bun there, but yeah. I've taken photos on Instagram in this um people thought it was real some people were like no you didn't cut your hair no way you cut your hair but yeah so um i'm digging this one i love this one it feels so soft and so airy this is so cute i feel like i need like wing eyeliner and like a cooler makeup look for this one so if you want to get any wigs I would go to Amazon and either look up lace front wigs or just like a certain type of wig that you want. Personally, I wouldn't pay more than like $35 for a wig or $36 for a wig uh, just because I'm cheap and there's so many cheap ones on Amazon with like good quality hair. So yeah, if you're looking for a cheap wig, Amazon is totally the place to go. I will definitely leave all the links of the wigs in the bio just in case you missed it. I think I might get more. Comment down below the colors I should get because I kind of want to get like blue, a purple. Oh my god, a lilac purple. They have this one in lilac purple and I was like, oh my god, I should totally get that. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you have any questions, make sure you leave them in the comments below. Share this video and subscribe to our channel. We are almost at 500 subscribers, which when you think about it is a lot of people. So we're really appreciative of all of you and we hope that the family grows. So yeah, we will see you in our next video. Bye guys.